What's up guys, it's Eric from Ferris Engineering, and today we're gonna to do something fun with our two five axis CNC mills. We have a Haas UMC 750 SS, and we have a DMU 50. They're running the same parts. So what's more race car guy than running a drag race on the same parts? So we're gonna be making some UCW wing uprights, and we're gonna basically press go at the same time and see what the time difference is between the machines. I have turned up the wick a little bit on the DMG, but it's a more rigid machine, it can handle it. If I started pushing the machine, the UMC as hard as I pu I'm pushing the DMG, the UMC would definitely not like it. Um, you can just feel that the machine is already pushing it pretty hard on that side. So we're gonna see what happens. Let's get to it. Ready, set, go. As far as what's changed between the two programs, I just basically increased the feed rate of the DMG during roughing and then a few of the other operations. There's nothing too crazy that went on between the uh, two machines other than um, the rapids of the DMG are faster than the Haas and I increased the feed rate of the DMG because it's a more rigid machine. All the tool paths otherwise are the same, so the difference in time is ultimately from the changes in rapids and the ability of the DMG to cut a little bit harder and uh, faster than what the Haas can, um, given the work holding of this specific part. All right, guys, so we took a piece of 6061 and we made some wing mounts, UCW, in this video. And as you can see, the DMG is quite a bit quicker. It's about 25% faster in cycle time than our Haas currently. Now that's not to say that the Haas is a terrible machine. It has not been a good machine for us, but that is a reliability issue, not so much a speed issue. Um, if the Haas had, has been reliable to us or had been reliable to us, probably would have kept it. But at this point, we're actually selling the machine and probably getting another DMG. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, we might do some more drag races before the Haas is out of here. But until next time, don't forget to like and subscribe. See ya.